Hello, I'm Marsha Williams, director and the actor for Dreadlock in Scary Face Man, Dreadlock's Revenge. And with me... Uh, I'm Joe, I guess. I helped with the video a lot. I'm uh, Zach. I helped do the camera angles and input for certain scenes. Um, actually, we, uh, we're redoing this because I actually... Um, brought up the wrong version, so we're actually doing this again, so I hope it's not the wrong version. What you're seeing here is a recap of what just previously happened, and Joe, I think, just got his butt kicked at Pokemon, oh, but... fucking missed. And, um... So really, only me and Marshall are devoting time to this. <laughs> I'll see somebody <laughs> with feel like it. Oh, I think there'll be a certain part Joe has something to say about <laughs> Yeah, um, I know. But anyways, yes, recap. This is, um... Nameless Kid's Death. It's hard to talk over John Carpenter's Halloween music, so... Assistant Director, Joseph Ayanasi. No, I'm not an assistant director. I didn't help. Um, <laughs> I kinda just sat by and did nothing. Yeah, nice, <laughs> nice sec. Nice. <laughs> I sat there and looked dumb the entire time. <laughs> He just held the camera and said, <laughs> Anyways, now that we're done with the pointless montage that I just need to add because... Yeah, now that we're done bickering and my bitching is over. Alright. And now... <clears throat> so here's Joe and Johnny. Johnny's a short one. Joe's the Asian. And they're running nah. to a random house nah. that happens to be unlocked. We apologize ahead of time for Johnny. Johnny is a poor actor. <laughs> Very sorry for that. Thunder punch. But Joe, he's just a he's just a delight. Just Joe a, is a I'm tank. Just a class when it born comes. actor. He's just no training talent. Joe, so if Joe, you wanna, if you want to manage him, Joe, I have a confession to make. I think uh, Rad is a better actor. Seems to be uh, more just natural ah, with it. Fuck. And I uh, hope that suspense cord will scare one of you guys. Yeah, it scared me because I spilled my gator. <laughs> I wasn't Anyways, filming that scene, just so we're clear. This scene was done kind of at, um, just because this is Joe's idea. Once again, hard to talk over the Exorcist music. I don't know, I think we'll, I think we'll be alright. We can always turn down the video later. Discharge! So here we go, Joe's Surfer calling guy. Surfer Guy, who was previously seen on Killer Tales Part 3. My idea. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> and, um, actually, um, you can, I don't know, the, the Frank Stallone music kind of goes over it, but he mentions the whole, um, Joe and Marshall mentioning the, um, Killer Tales being alive or whatever. Well, yeah, Surfer Dude was kind of my idea, I suppose. Yeah, it's pretty much was, yeah. Not for this particular video, but for the last Killer Tales. Oh. I think it's ironic that you have a killer in the daylight and yeah um dreadlock has got some serious balls dude he goes out in the morning here's johnny a, you don't see that often here's johnny being a nerd and I this well. i think i think my i think the original idea of just having johnny being pushed over would have been kind of funny but at the same time maybe we were gonna have him be masturbating and then just get his di like his hands slammed into his dick and then he just like dies I think instead, instead you get the greatest a keyboard would have been funny. Instead you get the greatest death of all time that will be on fail blog in like two days. Probably not like even. Like the killer It'll be within like five hours of this video airing. Here here it is, here it is. The killer titty grab. Everyone's silent. <laughs> oh! oh god. <laughs> What we're supposed to be having is I was supposed to be tearing out his heart, but it turned out that I literally... It turned out it was like a fatal nipple grab, so... I, I exploded... Well, it wasn't fatal, because he doesn't die. <laughs> it's just very injury. Uh, spoiler alert for the third, um... Surfer Dude is not dead. I think Surfer Dude can die, because Surfer no. Dude's like a secret he agent. Die. He, he like, worked die. with Rorschach, so I'm not sure he can die. <laughs> you know, we should put Rorschach just on the next one, just to piss off Alan Moore. I think so. I, I like how Johnny, you don't even know what he's doing. He's like clapping his hands, he's waving them, <laughs> you don't know what's happening. Here's my favorite part. 
my Zach's objective Zach's input game. here. That was uh, Zach's idea. His creative input. My creative impulse told me that would be good. Now this scene we had this, so much this trouble. This just with. shows how bad of an actor Johnny was because we had to try that so many times. That's not that hard. Yeah, it's not and hard. But now he's got a call. Look at him haul. Look at him haul ass. Yeah. He looks Run, just like me. the guy got his neck broken. <laughs> <laughs> Well, yeah, I'm right behind you. I kind of like how Johnny, like, you can't really tell he runs away, so you kind of half expect Johnny to just be sitting there. <laughs> I guess it would have helped if we would have shown Johnny cowering, but this is basically supposed to be from Johnny's point of view right here. No, I don't know about you guys, but I'd be shitting my dick off. Now, here we go, the, the traditional, <clears throat> well, gonna be traditional... Uh, First Blood, Part 1, Long Road soundtrack, plus montage. I think we should, here. I think there should be a Scary Man Dreadlock soundtrack, and I think this should be the first <laughs> single off of it. Just uh, get a collection of any you guys, songs. Any you guys want to go and make music for the series? It's going to be awesome. It'll be nice to see you guys. I know out of my only 176 subscribers, one of you guys has got to be able to do music. I don't know. I can do it, but I can only do so much. Just make some music. You and Tucker will have to do yes. it. Huh? Yeah, when we get recording gear again. <laughs> now here we go, the classic black and white montage that will be eventually classic. Just look how epi epically we run. If oh, somebody yeah. wants to support a DVD, <laughs> yeah, if one of you guys <laughs> want to support a DVD, send us something. We send can't us link link DVD. We can't solicit anything to you, so. We're just going to say, <coughs> you know, donations are <coughs> welcome. Just, uh, <coughs> wink, wink. I like money. We like money over here at Blank and Blank Productions of Partial Villains Incorporated. Uh, um, Spidey Man 2099 films, which I'm probably going to have to change eventually. Yeah, that probably will have to be changed into. You know what, why don't you guys come up with like a name for my company? Yeah, it's, come up with a good one that doesn't necessarily not revolve around one person. So that when it grows up... And nothing like Eyeball product. Eyeball Productions? I don't know. Eyeball Productions. But it's kind of like... Refrigerator in your butthole production. No, that's too explicit. <laughs> Nobody will take you seriously. That'd be nice. So I'm gonna come up with a good one, like... Marshall Bell himself. Dog Express. Yeah, but see, that would just go with you as a director. Though. Mars Films. Mars. Films. Mars Shuttle Films. Mars Productions. Mars Shuttle Films. Shuttle. Where does yeah. shuttle come from? Mars. Because you gotta shuttle. take a shuttle to get to outer space and then to Mars. Mars Incorporated. It's not bad, but it seems kind of like a spacey thing. But you could have a badass logo on kind of like Universal, but with the like Mars. With Mars and a shuttle flying around it. Yeah, and then as it goes by, it like spells out Mars. And then it goes shh, and then like flies off into the corner. And then, and then M is like for Marshall, and A is for like, Agenda, and R is for like, Regency. Mm. And S is for shit. Yeah. Something like that. Shitty climaxes. <laughs> no, because that'd be like two, you'd have to like, hyphen them together or something. Oh, titty grab that yeah. failed. <laughs> that actually did grab my nipple too. Didn't think he it. has no nipple anymore. Oh my god! All right. Well, anyways, there's me giving you guys the finger, and then going into another pose. <laughs> Watch this. Oh, you get double. But anyways, uh, thanks for watching, and um, those bloopers will be coming. So.